Good evening, I'm Sharice Gibson. And I'm Katie Moore. Students from the Tulane University School of Medicine, they're making headlines around the world. It's because this next generation of pediatricians, surgeons, and psychiatrists are looking back at the ancestors who laid their foundation. Devin Bartolotta brings us the viral photo and how it fits into the big picture. The juxtaposition of history and the future has caught the world's attention. When I was presenting this to some of my classmates, um, I told them, I was like, yo, this is going to be iconic. I was like, this will be iconic. We have about two years left. Russell Lede, a second year student at the Tulane University School of Medicine, is the psychiatrist in training behind these viral photos, taken during a visit to the Whitney Plantation in St. John the Baptist Parish. 15 black doctors in the making, fists held high, standing in front of former slave quarters. We were reminded that, like, we didn't, you know, we came here through resiliency. The photos have sparked conversation around the world about how much the U.S. has changed, but still how far there is to go. A lot of the times there's, there's no representation, if you get misrepresentation, there's no representation of you know, people of color in white coats on walls. Benetta Horn from the Office of Multicultural Affairs at Tulane helps keep all those students in white coats. I'm confident that they're going to be great physicians. I'm more proud that they're great people. She knows them personally, pushes them to be their best, and while she didn't expect the overwhelming response of the photos, she says it shows representation is critical in the big picture. A black boy or a black girl who's never seen a black doctor. If you don't see that as a possibility, you have no way to conceive that that could be me. Changing the image of what a physician looks like. That history is just part of what we're working with, you know, for us to be where we are now. A future those who lived in these quarters may have never imagined. Melody says he'd like to see thousands of copies of the photos hanging in classrooms across the country to motivate and inspire the next generation of diverse doctors.